Oh, I'm here. I am here. I'm on vacation, and I couldn't find a Walmart, but I did find a Target. So the pursuit of the perfect pocketbook in Target. Why not? And I'm still looking for a pair of earrings to match this blouse. Anyway, let's go. We'll use this cart to save someone the time from having to bring it in. And perfect, a spot for my coffee, as the pursuit of the perfect pocketbook continues. In Target. Target. Hoping for some pocketbook luck and some earring luck as well. But, apparently, I'm trying to go in the out. Don't mind me. I'm from out of town. I quickly realize this Target is the complete opposite of the one I'm used to shopping in, so just a minute. Success. Pocketbooks at the other end of the store. They appear a little disheveled, but we'll take a look. We'll start on the bottom with Boring Brown. Forty dollars. It's not leather. Cell phone pocket. A few compartments. No feet. Eh. Forty-five dollars for the lighter brown. It's a leather-like material, but I'm pretty certain it's some kind of vinyl. And what's up with this zipper? Has two poles on it, like you see on luggage. And no feet. Love this green. Thirty dollars. Again with this clasp, like we saw several times at Macy's. Handy cell phone pocket. No feet. It is cute. And sparkle. This would be an elegant evening bag. Let's check a price. Twenty-five dollars. It's a little tangled, but I think it comes with a long ass-bouncing chain. And plenty of wicker. I'm not really a wicker pocketbook person. It makes me think of hot air balloons. And this screams lobster trap in hot pink for twenty-eight bucks. Honestly, it's kind of awkward. I've given up, so on to earrings. Only eight dollars for several pairs of hoops. These are delicate, shiny, and also eight dollars. Oops. So if anyone is wondering why I disinfect my earrings before I wear them, this is a perfect example. Accidents happen. Honestly, I'm not super excited about any of these earrings, and it appears as though they carry the same pairs, but in gold. But then I spot the sugar fix. I love me some sugar fix. But it's February. These are Halloween. Are they on clearance? And Christmas lights for ten dollars. I'm not seeing a clearance sign. But drop the mic has my attention for thirteen dollars. How fun for karaoke! Thirteen dollars for some ice creams that dangle, I guess. And I'm pretty certain we saw these back in September. Belief in yourself. Slow burn for fifteen dollars has fun colors. Something to do with a CD. Well, these don't match my blouse, but they're my number one choice for today. Globe Trotter. I love these colors together. Target was not a great success. We found some bland pocketbooks and some earrings that should be on clearance, so we're leaving with nothing. But the pursuit of the perfect pocketbook will continue at Nordstrom's. But keep your fingers crossed that I can find my way out of here. Thanks for shopping with me. Rock on.